My name is Brett Reinford and we're here at Reinford Farms. In 2008, we built our first digester, about a half a million gallon digester with a, a 140 kilowatt motor uh, attached to it. Um, we built that in 2008 because of some odor complaints we were getting from our, our neighbors. And um, we found out we could take food waste. And from 2008 to 2017, we were taking a bunch of food waste and we kind of outgrew that uh, digester because of food waste we were taking as well as the cow numbers increased as well. So in 2019, we installed a 1.5 million gallon digester with a 500 kilowatt motor attached to it. And um, we were able to take more food waste, add additional cow numbers, and uh, continue, continue to, to reduce odor and keep our neighbors happy. My name is John Gleisner. I'm the director of the Pottsville Fresh Distribution Center. Um, we've had a partnership now with Reinford since 2019. In uh, 2019, Dollar General began our fresh initiative with DG Fresh where we're doing self-distribution of our refrigerated and frozen product, which includes fluid milk. Uh, part of that process is we have to have a disposal method for our expired or out of temperature milk. The partnership that we have with Reinford allows us to send this product back to be repurposed, both to generate energy as well as create um, fertilizer for their farm. Right now we're at our uh, food waste recycling facility at Reinford Farms. Um, this is where we destroy all of our uh, packaged waste uh, from the various clients that we work with. Um, the, the machine behind me is called the depackager and that's where everything is destroyed and, and from that, that's, that point on uh, the liquid waste is then uh, injected into our digester to be recycled. we found uh, with our digesters and the benefit of having them has been uh, pretty tremendous on our farm. So from a, from a food waste standpoint, uh, you know, we're paid to take uh, the food waste so there's a profitability um, aspect of a digester. But also for the original reason that we built the digester of reducing odor. So it does reduce odor for us. Um, our digesters um, also produce all the bedding for our cows as well. Um, so we're, we're able to use the manure solids to better cows, saving us money there. Um, both motors have uh, heat exchangers on them that we capture all the heat. Uh, our original digester uh, and the heat that's generated heats all of our hot water on our facilities, heats our farmhouse, heats our shop, uh, heats the milking parlor, and so uh, dries all the corn that we, uh, that we harvest and shell here on the farm. And then our, um, our new digester, uh, was, we were using it to use uh, the heat we're using it to heat our calf barn uh, and, um, and, and use it as a backup source for our other digester as well. The fertilizer value uh, is, is definitely increased because of the food waste that we're bringing in. Uh, some of the high protein uh, food waste that we, we bring in like milk or, or some of the, the meat products uh, generate additional uh, fertilizer values for us. In 2023, Dollar General was able to divert over 13,000 tons worth of milk product from landfills. Over 11,000 tons of milk product went back to feed suppliers to be used to make high quality animal feed. And 1,700 tons came out of our Pottsville facility to come back to Brett to be able to use that for his initiatives for generating electricity. You know, part of Dollar General's commitment to our communities is to provide sustainability. Uh, so this is one of the ways we're able to help do that. Our digesters. Um, produce electricity with the generators that are attached to them so we're able to sell any excess um, power back to the grid and right now it's about 500 homes a day's worth of power.